Hi guys, it's Colette and today we're going to be working on these pink and purple stripes. If you love nail art, be sure you subscribe to my channel, My Simple Little Pleasures. And if you'd like to see how I did this, just stay tuned. Starting out with clean dry nails, we're going to begin with a base coat. I'm using Ready for Takeoff, which is a peel off base. And you can use whichever is your personal favorite. The polishes that I'm going to be using today are from Zoya. Most of them are pixie dusts. This is Stevie, kind of a pinkish mauve. Then we have Arabella, moving into more of a fuchsia. Then we have Carter, getting kind of more purple. Then for a periwinkle, we have Alice. And finally, moving into almost a navy, we have Sunshine. I'm going to be using these colors for the nail art. And for my base color, I'm going to be using Zoya Trixie. I have a small lid that I'll be putting my polish out on as well as a small brush which I'll be using to paint my lines and I'm just going to get started with the lightest color to start sketching out the design do that for all my nails and then move on to the other colors
once you're done with the stripes, you can go ahead and do any cleanup that's needed before moving on to top coat. And I'm going to be doing two layers just to deal with any texture left from the pixie dust. So here's the finished manicure and I'm really pleased with how these turned out. I think you can definitely see that it has the same kind of inspiration as the turquoise and green kind of gradient stripes that I did before, but the pattern is different enough that it definitely stands alone as its own manicure. Of course I had a lot of fun doing this live and if you'd like to join me to hang out while I do nail art, you can come drop a follow over at twitch.tv slash MSLP. Or, if you'd just like to check out the archive, that will be posted here to YouTube in the next couple of days. I'd love to hear what you guys think of this color combination down in the comments. If you enjoyed, I hope you'll leave a like. And of course, as always, thanks for watching.